It is a special occasion and always one to be cherished. Who will go down in history as the winners of the FA Cup? It's Manchester United. They face Manchester City and it's live right here on EA TV. At long last, the wait is over. A warm welcome to Wembley. This is Derek Ray, joined in the commentary box by Stuart Robson, and we're approaching kickoff time in what promises to be a spectacular FA Cup final. It's Manchester United facing Manchester City. Well, Derek, as a youngster growing up, this was the day that every young footballer dreamt of. Playing in the FA Cup final, walking out in front of 100,000 fans at Wembley, broadcast around the world, it still brings a tingle to my spine. And I'm really looking forward to this one. Number 10, Marcus Rashford. Number 8, Bruno Fernandes. And number 9, Anthony Martial. This is the team Manchester United will go with. David De Gea begins in goal. Luke Shaw starts with Aaron Wan-Bissaka in the fullback positions. Casemiro plays alongside Christian Eriksen in the centre of midfield. And up front today is Anthony Martial. And so they start at 11 for Manchester City. Ederson begins in goal. Manuel Akanji plays with Kyle Walker as fullbacks. Kevin De Bruyne starts with Rodri in central midfield. And leading the line today is Erling Haaland. And this confrontation is underway. And a timely intervention. Well, he's a player who just seems to get better and better. I'm talking, of course, about Bruno Fernandes. Stuart, what do oh, you... Oh, Derek, great opportunity here. And there it is! The opener in the derby falls for United. And how much does it mean to them? Just listen. Well, let's take another look. Yeah, he won't get an easier finish than that. The defending was all over the place, though. So City get things going again, and the onus is on them to erase the damage done by that concession. Mares, a chance to whip it in. The referee spotted the infringement, and it will be a free kick in a position of genuine menace. Well, City are so unlucky not to be level now, but you do sense a goal is coming. Well read to ease the pressure. Gundogan. United might be able to cash in, and a close offside decision as they were threatening.
It's going to be United's free kick. He's going forward well here, but quick thinking defensively. And space to exploit, maybe. Martial, a good and fair challenge. And he has options available. Mares. Holland. Magnificent challenge to win it back. Ruben Dias. Walker now. Well, City, as the stats highlight, have had most of the ball, but without really creating enough chances. They've almost passed the ball for the sake of it. They need to start getting it into their front players much quicker to get back into this. Applying vigorous pressure. Shaw. Martial. And with that, the first half comes to an end here at Wembley Stadium. The ball is moving again. City trailing going into the second half. Will they come up with the right response? De Bruyne. Well, just the tackle that was needed. They might be able to get in now. And the keeper, there to deal with it. Well, there's the confirmation. That was nowhere near to crossing the line, was it? Trying to pick out a teammate. Well, a bit short with the clearance. Rashford. Nicely timed tackle. Grealish and you need your defender to take charge Holland high quality defending Anthony Martial good looking sequence De Bruyne, big chance to get them on terms. Oh no, it's gone a begging. Well, they can't miss opportunities like that. What a chance to equalise. A change in the offing for City. Anthony. Well, that's a super ball over the top. And there it is! A two-goal cushion now, and just look at these fans! The trophy coming their way, surely!
Well, here it is again. The ball over the top is an absolute beauty, and Martial couldn't hit this any better. What a great finish this is. And the ball is moving again. 2-0 is how it stands. That's a really good run. Throw into Manchester City. And Manchester City will go to their bench. To be replaced by number 47, Phil Fender. Now he must favour the cross. Gundogan. And he takes on the shot. It's one of the saves of the season from De Gea. Over it comes and clears his lines. And plenty of scope to be creative in that wide position. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Now options are plenty. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. And it looked like open road for them, but up a dead end. Mares. Oh, that's a pass of high quality. Not the easiest of situations for the keeper. So a personnel change then. Substitution. A city corner it is. Coming off the pitch, number 29, Aaron Wambasaka. Coming onto the pitch, number 20, Yogo Dalit. Can someone get on the end of this? Well, they had a decent reading of that ball in. Mares. Erling Haaland. And Varane foiling them. It's going to be United's free kick. And there goes the final whistle. The cup issue is settled. A story of one side celebrating and the other distraught. Memories are being made. Well, just look at those scenes down there, Derek. What a contrast in emotions. Brilliant for the winners, despair for the losers. But overall, the right team won today. Yeah, you can see what it means to this tight-knit team. Real solidarity. Well, this is special for everybody at the club. What a great moment for any young player. And this is what you dream about when you start playing football. When you're playing in the playground, you want to win a cup. Brilliant moment. Yes, a special moment in the career of any footballer. And now for the trophy lift itself. The cup winners. Well, you can just see what it means to those players and the manager. That's fantastic stuff. There's always the element of chance in a cup competition. But my goodness, they've taken the rough with the smooth. And now they savour the moment. Four marks to the entire team, and now they get the chance to exhale and enjoy. They've been brilliant in this competition, and so have the fans. They've really got behind their team. They've played a big part in this win. Just look at those faces in the crowd. Great stuff. They're really a match made in heaven between players and fans. And these celebrations are going to continue for quite some time. A 
And now the players get to relax a bit and enjoy having the pictures taken. Well, these photos will be cherished for years to come, won't they? Certainly ones to show the grandchildren.